Ten months after a local teacher was arrested and charged with child abuse, that charge against her has been dropped. 61-year-old Caroline Lee taught for a decade at Darnell Cookman School of the Medical Arts. She was named Teacher of the Year last year. Well, Joy is here now. And Joy, there are several reasons the charge was dropped. Mary and Kent, those are detailed in this document from the state attorney's office called a disposition statement, a notice to drop the charge. The student is not identified in this statement. I spoke with both Caroline Lee and her attorney over the phone tonight. Both declined to comment for our story. Lee has vehemently denied the child abuse charge ever since her arrest in October of last year. It made national and international headlines when then 60-year-old Caroline Lee was arrested and charged with child abuse. Police say the recently named Teacher of the Year at Darnell Cookman School of the Medical Arts hit a student in the face. With no witnesses to the incident and no video footage, the state attorney's office cited several reasons for dropping the charge. Lee passed a polygraph test when asked about the incident. Lee also has no criminal record. And the student who accused Lee of abuse has a history of fighting in schools, according to the state attorney's notice to drop the charge. The report says the student was posting threatening messages about the teacher online. Lee asked the student to have a private conversation about the messages. It was after that private meeting, the student accused Lee of slapping and kicking her, making her nose bleed. But the state attorney's office says the student was wearing a mask, preventing the teacher from seeing the student's nose or mouth. Both parties agree that a student desk sat between them during the alleged incident. And the state attorney's office describes the student as significantly taller than the teacher's five foot two inch frame and that given the relative size of the parties, it would have been extremely difficult for the teacher to have struck the student in the face. Now, last year, after Darnell Cookman families were told about the teacher's arrest, the principal said Lee was removed from the classroom and would not return pending the judicial and internal procedures. No word tonight whether Lee will return to the Duval County school system or whether the student who accused Lee of abuse will face any type of punishment.